Okay, tennis coach Robert here. We're just gonna do some general exercises that are critical for us to improve as tennis players. So the exercises that I want you guys to do is of course making sure you're moving. The more you can make these with some type of movement, the better you're gonna be. So we want to make sure we're walking. Okay, so the most important exercise for tennis is to make sure we're walking forward and backwards. So throughout the day, anytime you have an opportunity, walk. Okay? The next thing that I want you to do is incorporate some lunges. So you walk a little bit and you create a lunge. Okay? So you walk a little bit and you create a lunge. Okay? We can go low. You don't have to go all the way down. So here I'm going with a small one and going down deep. I can go ahead and tie my shoes or something like that. And we make sure we work on that type of business. If I can't go down too much, we do these small lunges. Remember, these are critical for us as tennis players. The next exercise that I want you guys to work on is the squat. Okay, so we go ahead and we make sure you just get into these small squat movements like this. We can do these squats all day long like this. Every time we sit down, we sit down without using a um, using our hands, okay, and we, if we get comfortable, we can go down and sit into a position like this, and we can pick up balls, we can do all these different things here. When we're down here squatting, we can use the hands and do different things, stay down in these kind of positions, and so on to help us to get into a better tennis uh, movement, okay? That's gonna help us with our uh, ready position and so on, okay. The next thing that I want you all to do on a regular basis would be just a general push-up, okay? So we do a little bit of a push-up. So we go down here and we do a general regular push-up. If you can't do a regular push-up, we're just doing this because in tennis, you have to push. So we need to make sure we're doing some pushing type exercises. You can do it against the wall. You can go down here and you can do this. If you can't do that, we just go ahead and do a, uh, if you can do that, sorry, you do a regular push-up. We're making sure that we are pushing with the arms. Okay, the next one that I'm going to talk about briefly is just to make sure we work on the core here. So I'm going to go here in this position just like a push-up. And I'm going to have my feet um, in this position and I'm going to lift my knees up. So I go into a position like this. This is going to help me with my core. So you want to make sure. If your hands are comfortable, not comfortable like this, you can put them on top of each other and just go up like this. Make sure the back is straight so that we're working on the core, okay? The next thing we want to do is want to add some kinds of twist action. So I'm here, I just twist and twist. Make sure I get some twisting action going. And we can go ahead and work on twisting by turning the body so I get into a position like this and I twist my body around, okay? I twist, work on twisting, okay? And that's uh, a position that's gonna help me with a twist. So these are some exercises that I want you guys to do. So we get here, we roll back as we're getting up. We make sure that as often as possible, we're using these um, movements to exercise. The next thing we're going to talk about is just to work on the twist and the push and everything else. We're going to go ahead and start punching. So we're going to do a lunge. We're going to do a lunge. We're going to do a twist and a push. So here, move your feet. Lunge, lunge, pull, twist, push. So that's your punch. So we want to make sure we're doing these on a regular basis because that's going to help us with your forehand, okay? The next one we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and work on the lower body so we don't have to go very high, very similar. Lunge, lunge, kick. So we're gonna go ahead, lunge, lunge, kick. Okay, and we're kicking the ball using the laces. So we're kicking, making sure, because this will help us with this particular motion. The next thing I want you guys to work on is making sure that your arms are up high. 
reach up as high as possible. If you can, you can hang from something. Okay, this is like hanging from a um, chin-up bar. Just make sure we get up here because this is going to help us with our serves. We need to make sure we have good reach up here. So make sure that you're able to get all the way up here. Okay, and to do this, a good warm-up would be like a ski motion. So we go down here into a squat position here and then we come all the way up and reach up. Make sure we reach up nice and high. So we go down into a squat position like we're skiing and then we come up and of course you can go ahead and do this faster and if you want to add a jump you can do that to make it a little more dynamic so it's completely up to you. So these are just a few exercises that are critical for our warm-up, okay? So I want to see you guys walking and doing some running and doing some twisting and doing some pushing. I didn't do pulling today, but I will do that next time and we make sure that we go ahead and do it. I wanna just add two more really quick ones which I, from the ground, which it would be to make sure that we're doing bear crawls these are very important that we're crawling and then some crab walks where we're on the back side and we're walking backwards okay these are very important because you can do this with your children you can do this with your grandchildren and this is good exercise for them to see you so spending some time on the ground is going to be critical all right thank you all very much and I'll catch you guys next time. For more information on Carbo Tennis, visit www.carbotennis.com. If you wish to email Coach Robert, please do so at robert at carbotennis.com or visit his Facebook page at www.facebook.com forward slash carbotennis. Tennis for the people. This video was an ADCI LLC production and was filmed at the North Pinellas YMCA located in Palm Harbor, Florida.